Yeah. You are video. You are video. You are video. Alright, guys. Something dramatic just happened. Whew. I just woke up from a nap. I had a long day. Yeah. I'm sitting at 300,000. Stacking some trades. As you guys can see, gold. If you guys look at the gold chart, gold spiked down exactly at 6 o'clock as soon as Tokyo Sessions hit. Something major dramatically just happened during the Asian Sessions. Look at that. Look at that crazy drop all the way down to 1256. That's telling you something. This is on the 15 minute chart. I was really, sh I was really, really shocked to see this. How much did it spike down? Spike down to 1256.50. So everyone's trying to sell gold, I guess. You guys can see that I'm on the five minute here. I'm on the five minute chart. Let you guys see this. You know. Yeah, there it is. Look at that candle. That red candle spike down. Um, I was really shocked to see this. I wasn't expecting this to happen, but like I said, anything can happen. So, worth the sell tonight as we move on for Asian sessions. Over 300k in demo profit. I am sitting over 500,000 in equity for the demo contest right now. Half a million. Like I said, 300. So. USD JPY went up to 110. 110.8. 110.8. Like I said, I won't be surprised if it hits 111 tonight. Because that's the first resistance point that it needs to hit. Oh, uh, man. I don't know what else I got. Uh, I just. We took a nap, right, girl? Well, I don't think you did, but. <coughs> Uh, is there anything else going on? I'm trying to think what else is going on. Is there anything else that I need to pay attention to as of right now? I need to figure this out. I don't know. Uh, well, we don't, I don't really not worry about that. I don't care if they're talking about the dollar dropping. That I don't care. You cannot be fooled by USDJPY. There's other key events that happen with Japan, uh, as in the the national head of the security of Japan is is trying to resign, and they said that their inflation isn't really going the way it's supposed to go. Even though the yen is weak right now, that's what they, the headlines are saying from last night. So I think that's still carrying on for Asian session as of tonight. Even though US dollar misperformed today as well and it dropped again. Uh, there is two news. Oh, what's that? 1850, which means 650 my time. 650, so that's in 40 minutes. I mean, hold on, I'm in mean, 32 minutes. I'm... What's the matter with you? Mm, mm, mm. I think that's all I got for you guys. I mean, there is news for Australia for the tr trade balance at 8:30. I'm gonna get on that. I am gonna sell Australia because Australia hasn't even come back to hit 80 cents or above. 83 cents I think it was so I think it is worth the sell for Australia and New Zealand uh, as of right now oh, I'm not even selling New Zealand that's interesting uh, we will I guess I'll just wait till that happens I'm not even I don't have any sales on that right now I'm still selling Euro. I'll let you guys see Euro. Selling Euro and Euro GBP because the because the pound is a little bit stronger 
than than you are right now. You gotta think about pound is a dollar thirty two versus a dollar eighteen. Obviously, the pound's stronger. You just outweigh the math here. That's all I got for you guys. I will do another quick video when the trade balance hits at 8.30. Uh, if not, I will try to do a video at 7 p.m. Because 7 p.m. is crucial right after when uh, these two news hits for Japan. So that's all I got for you guys. So pay attention, stay focused. And make the old... Make, make, hey, okay. Alright. Catch them pips.